Have you learned how to play Siamese Mahjong? If you don't have enough players for a four-player game and you have another player interested, give it a try. Two players play two hands at one time. There's a link below the video to the lesson playlist. Check it out. In the meantime, watch this video where I do some random pulls that can give you an idea on what it's like to make decisions playing two hands at once. If you're new to Mahjong, or maybe new to Siamese style, or if you're an intermediate player and want to improve your game, consider subscribing to my channel. Click the bell when you do so you get notification for when I post new videos. That way you won't miss anything. Let's do some random pulls for Siamese Mahjong. I have all my tiles out and they have been mixed. When you play Siamese Mahjong, the dealer gets 20 eight tiles and the opponent gets 27. So I'm going to take 28 random tiles. We'll just say we're the dealer. Okay, let's see what we can do with these tiles. No BAMs. That's interesting. Look at all these dragons and winds. North, east, south. No jokers. I would think if we had jokers, we could play a quint because we do have dragons, winds, and multiples, but because we have no jokers I don't think a quint would be good in this case I'm thinking though a wind hand might be good maybe north and south with dragons would be one option and then for the other option we have a pair of ones a pair of one five seven nine what about an odd hand maybe even the odd pair hand Here's I think oops what I would do here so here's what I would do I try to make a decision so that I have eight discards this plan would leave six discards a wind and dragon hand whether it be north and south with dragons or all winds probably north and south with dragons and that would leave joker bait with the easts then down here i would play the odd pair hand that would be the third from the bottom we have a gap of no three dots though and then we would need to pair up one of these and then have the opposite suit so i would hold these we need either like a, a pair um i'm sorry pairs of one cracks and one bams pairs of three cracks and three bams or nine cracks and nine bams i would just hold them all until we paired up so this hand is a bit of a long shot i don't know if these would be winners but that's how i would play it so let's go ahead and do another random pull. If you would do something different here, write in the comment section, random pull one and what you would do differently. I like to build around multiples. I think that's the strongest strategy. So let's see what we can do. We have red and green. Then we have fives in cracks. Here's a two, three in bams and a one in the dots. We could play one, two, three, 
let me see here. We could maybe play two, three with dragons. This would be the third hand. I'm sorry, that would be the third hand from the bottom under consecutive run. And then we would definitely need to leverage these dragons here to leverage these dragons we could do huh, five six maybe a quint let's look at a quint instead up here how about a quint here three dragon and then one of these wins and then let's see if we can make something work here let's see so the multiples let's just pull all the multiples together one two green five One, two, green, five. They don't go together. Let's see here. We could play like numbers with fives. That would leave two sets of multiples for joker bait. Let's see here. That would leave... Okay, that would leave nine tiles with joker bait if we played this plan. Quint with these tiles here and then like numbers with fives. Let's see if there are any other options there. Let me see here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven towards a quint. If we did the one or the two, three dragon, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But that leaves, let's just look again. Two, three, dragon. And then for, we could still try for a quint here. Maybe that would be better. Use these for the quint up here and play two, three, dragon, joker bait here, and then we have 10 discards. Either way, we don't need any of those. Maybe hold the fives. If we hold the fives for potential like numbers, and then these as joker bait, that might be more helpful. Discard all of those. If you would do something different for random pull two, let me know. But I think that's what I would try here. Quint and then two, three with dragons. That would leverage almost all the multiples except for this one. Okay, we'll do it one more time. I see a lot of 369 and then we should leverage these souths for sure with something. Let's pull all the 369s together first. See all these 369s? 36, 36. 369. We could even play maybe the 369 pair hand. This would be the third one down under 369. 
369. I would try it. 369 pair hand. Then down here, if we could leverage these souths, maybe news with like numbers, in which case, maybe the fives. News with fives. We have one of each of the fives. So we would not be able to keep there. Uh, we wouldn't need that either. News with fives. Let's see. As an option, I think I would hold the red and that south. Maybe we could even force a quint. In which case I would hold the flower for potential joker bait. And that would give us eight discards with this plan. So 369 pair hand or 369 category. Lots of options there. Then this particular scenario would be news with fives or a quint. I would start by discarding all of these. Oh, we actually have all the ones too. So either, either news with fives or news with ones. Get rid of those first. If you would do something different with this set of random pulls, let me know. But that's what I would do here. Okay. Let me know what you think about Siamese Mahjong. If you haven't tried it yourself, write your comments below about your hesitancy to learn it. And then watch the lesson playlist. See if you'd be interested and maybe get a friend together and learn how to play. And then come back and let me know how it goes for you. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, click subscribe and then click the bell so you get notification for when I post new videos. That way you won't miss out on any opportunities to maybe learn some new strategies or pick up on some insights to the game that might give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next random pulls for Siamese Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.